Hey everybody, it's Blue Ducky, and welcome back to another episode of Toy Talk. Um, so this weekend was New York Comic Con. It's still going on as I'm talking right now. Um, but with any really big Comic Cons, toy companies like to do reveals on like Instagram and their social media websites. So there's a lot of new exciting pictures that I want to go through. Uh, mainly DC Superhero Girls, Monster High, and finally the uh, Disney Star Darlings. So let's get started. Um, first, here is a group photo of all the dolls together. They look really, really great. Uh, lots of detail in the clothing and accessories. So needless to say, I am very excited for them and here is one of Wonder Woman she has her golden lasso so that's cool and um, her outfit just the doll looks really detailed and I like how she looks and there's Bumblebee I got yelled at because I accidentally called her wasp which is a Marvel character not DC but her name is Bumblebee and I think she looks super cool. Look at that hair. She has side of her head is shaved. Um, and then, of course, her outfit is like bumblebee themed. Got some honeycomb sort of patterning on her leggings. And she just looks really, really cool. And then this is one of the two that I'm most excited about. And it's Poison Ivy. She looks so pretty, and that red hair is to die for. And then she has all her vine accessories. She's looking really, really pretty. And then we have my second favorite one that I'm really excited about is Harley Quinn. And she comes with her big mallet, which is really, really cool. The one thing about her that I don't understand, that I don't really see on any of the other pictures, is her leggings the black and the white not black and white red and black it the legs look like it you know you can tell it's molded on and it's not like fabric leggings which she's the only one that I really see that on uh, piggy tails red and blue it's it's I'm still really excited for her and then we have Batgirl here looking cool um, I don't remember Batgirl having purple, but I like that purple. I think it's pretty cool. And, uh, yeah. She looks amazing. And Supergirl looks really, really cute. Uh, I like how the faces are molded. Um, it's a really pretty face mold. And they each look unique. And so... As you can guess, we have moved on. The next set of pictures I have is from Monster High. Uh, Mattel, the official Monster High Mattel Instagram, they like to do little teaser pictures of accessories and then they'll do like a big reveal picture. So this one is a Batsy and these are her shoes which are awesome and then this one you can see really the detail of the hair she has blonde and lime green hair and accessories and her wings are really really cool and um, it looks like her headband is made of like stitched thatch grass and then finally the reveal of her from head to toe uh, she looks so, so pretty. Oh, I love the wings and her lime green makeup. And then the next one is of the, the troll character that is also a huge gamer, nerd, and for that fact alone, like, might be my favorite as far as personality because I, of course, like games and nerdy things. And her back, her bag looks like game console controller you know and then you can see in the outfit a little bit it looks pixelated really cool and then the another sort of detail shot here is the hat 
is like a beanie hat and then her horns like sticking through it and her glasses are pixelated and even her eyes are pixelated she's all about the video games here really cute um, I don't have any more of the Monster High photos they haven't been revealed on Instagram from official Mattel which um, but you know since there's so much news coming out, I'll probably have an update on uh, Nether Toy Talk next week. Um, and we'll have the photos then to look up close. But I like them because they're really, really clear. And th even these teaser ones are really, really cool because you get to see the details up close before you get to see the whole thing. Um, oh my goodness. Do you notice her earrings? It looks like like a skullet with like horns. Uh, I can't. Oh yeah, it is. It's a skullet with horns. Like yeah, because she's a troll. <laughs> so cute. Okay, and moving on to Disney Star Darlings. The books have been released. I have not found them yet, but I think they came out September 19th. And um, then the dolls are coming soon to justice which I cannot wait but I they do have a YouTube Star Darlings has a YouTube it's called Disney Star Darlings on YouTube and they have teasers teasers about episodes the animation looks great and they even have a full-length music video um, with the star song by Star Darlings, which the song is really, really good. I definitely recommend going checking it out. And some different shots of the books. And they also are going to have an app, Disney Star Darlings app. And this gives a little closer look. Like, it looks like you can play some games with it. And then I just want... This is, I think... This photo is from the music video, which, like I said, is really good. I love the song. Um, just, like, based on their looks right now, my favorite is this blue girl. I don't know her name. Did the book? Was the blue book? Oh, her name is covered. I'm not sure her name yet. But the blue girl, and then the drummer girl, because she got, like, a, like a gothic-looking skirt I like those two I really like the animation style it's really cute and sparkly and colorful and even the little critters are adorable look at this little critter it's like a bee it's so cute glow for it oh it's so cute and some other artwork here I think it's really cool, and they each play a different instrument. It's like a guitar, or is a guitar? I'm not sure. Oh, this is the 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 drummer girl. Her skirt's kind of rock and roll looking. I like her. And that's it for the pictures for Star Darlings. But I am really excited about this line. It kind of reminds me of like um is growing up there's rainbow bright and just like the colors and the style remind me of like a new fresh take on that sort of thing uh, but I can't wait to find the books and then the dolls and show you them up close they look so pretty the artwork is amazing so thank you guys so much for tuning in to another toy talk uh, it's a pretty short episode and um, I will have more toy talks for you guys soon. Make sure to like comment down below if you have questions or things in particular you would like to see on Toy Talk. And give this video a thumbs up. And if you're a new viewer, hit that subscribe button. I'll see you guys later.